This is Brian for PeakyNews.com. Pekingese puppies have something in common with children and infants. Teething is a difficult time for them. During the natural development phase, puppies typically want to chew on objects. It is easier to prevent any negative chewing during this time than attempting to rectify the problem the moment it gets started. The majority of Pekingese puppies get their initial set of teeth, which are extremely sharp, during their first four weeks of life, and their full set of adult teeth when they are about four months old. Their mouth gets sensitive at both stages, hence they tend to have an urge to chew. However, they need to be aware that apart from toys, they are not supposed to bite or chew on any other objects. You should get them some hard and durable plastic toys or first synthetic teething bones from a local pet store. However, human toys for puppies should be avoided because they could be easily destroyed and the puppy can swallow tiny parts. It can result in choking or harm its digestive system, leading to long-term health issues for the puppy. You may also provide your dog with fresh raw bones when outside, especially knuckle plus marrow bones to help them relieve some of the teething pressure. Make sure that you remove all objects that the puppy may be tempted to chew. Correcting the chewing habit in a Pekingese puppy. Place toys in the puppy's den area or box and remove other items that they may want to chew. It will get your puppy used to chewing only what you want him to eat. However, leather and rawhide toys which can strip and choke a puppy should be avoided. Don't play any games that involve your puppy mouthing, biting, or wrestling with any member of your family. Pekingese puppies need to know that none of your family members are littermates and should also be capable of differentiating between proper and improper habits. A toy should be used as a biting or chewing object in any game. In case your puppy chews on furniture or other items, spray-on products can make the item unpleasant and stop the puppy from chewing. Don't ever hit your Pekingese puppy or punish him harshly if you catch him chewing on an item because doing so will only make him distrust you. In fact, it will make it harder for you to train him in other areas. If you choose on an object, just say, no chewing, loudly and firmly. It will stop the habit. However, you need to provide him with an appropriate toy and then shower him with praise when he chews on the right items. In case the chewing persists in spite of your best efforts, it will be necessary to consult a veterinarian. Your Pekingese could be chewing because of an unbalanced diet or medical disorder. However, such cases are rare. The veterinarian could also help you recommend a trainer who could guide you on how to work with your dog and rectify the problem. If you enjoyed this video, you're more than welcome to like the video and subscribe to our channel for more great videos.